Okay, just test fitting all the engine components now that parts are, are painted. Um, and one thing that is standing out is this um, exhaust ring here, or um, I think it's an exhaust ring. Um, and um, there is location pins on some, but not all of these little um, connection points here. Um, and possibly because it's been painted, um, possibly um, it's just how it's molded, but some of the connection pins don't go all the way down into their uh, mating hole. Um, so it's probably worth a good bit of checking this out before you start building things up. It's easier to test fit this now without the other components built up um, in front of it. Uh, and just make sure things fit. And if they don't, um, just remove the pin. I mean, this is, anyone who's build, been building models for, for many years know that um, location pins often um, are more of a hindrance than a help. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take that pin off at that point there so that it, it clicks all the way down. Um, it, if you remove all the pins, it will mean uh, aligning it will be more difficult. But in fairness, most of the other pins I don't appear to have an issue with or at least... Um, not a major issue with. So what I can do is just shorten the pins so I have a little nub. So I'm going to go and try and do that. So I've shortened all the pins now except for um, one, um, which is going to be used as the uh, locating pin, this one here. So let's have a go. Okay, so my fit is much better for shortening the pins. You can see I've left just a little location nub just on the end there. That means the fit's going to be a lot better. Um, it does mean we have to um, sort of glue one in at a time and uh, get it organised and um, just clamp it together. But we'll use a little bit of medium CA and that'll make that a nice quick job. So that's my tip on the engine. Everything else on the engine um, goes together lovely. Um, I have checked out the um, paint um, call outs given by the instructions and they do seem to be correct for a mark one um, so um, there's a lot of black on here so let's build up the engine the next thing to say is that the um, build sequence of these parts laid out in the instructions is perfectly fine but I'm not going to quite do it that way I'm personally going to find it easier to add this part onto here before attaching it onto the main assembly. And the same with this part, which fits in the back here. Um, because the fit of these parts is quite tight and quite fiddly, it's just gonna be easier to attach those before you attach these pieces to the to the main assembly. Otherwise, um, you know, you can follow the instructions and, and it, it's not a problem. I just personally think it's gonna be easier to attach the small parts first. Right, with that in mind, let's show you the build-up stages of the engine and I'll have another update out to you soon and a full build diary where you'll see this in more detail coming in the not too distant.